Here in Washington, this November election means a rematch between Governor Christine Gregoire and challenger Dino Rossi. Only 129 votes separated the candidates four years ago, and polls have them in a tight race once again. Both candidates appeared in Spokane tonight, and KXLY4's Eric Cloney was there when they did. Eric? Yeah, both Chris Gregoire and Dino Rossi appeared at a candidate forum tonight. It wasn't a debate, so they spoke at different times during the program. A recent poll shows Dino Rossi six percentage points ahead of Gregoire, but another poll out today shows Gregoire up by two percentage points. Now, tonight's forum was organized by the Arca Spokane, an organization that helps people with developmental disabilities. Both candidates said they will continue to support funding for people with special needs even during these tough economic times. We spoke to Dino Rossi and Chris Gregoire, and they disagreed about the state of the state deficit. We do not have a deficit today. We're one of the few states in America that has a surplus. It's one of the largest surpluses in the history of the state of Washington. So I'm actually very proud of it. Now, if we end up in a deficit, obviously that surplus and that rainy day fund that we put in place will be key to make sure we don't have to cut essential services. Yeah, that's an alternate universe you have to be in to, to, to really believe there's no deficit because what she's saying is that we have this big $800 million surplus. What that's like is that you got 800 bucks in your checking account. You have $3,500 that, that's due on January 1st. Uh, you're $2,700 upside down, aren't you? But all you want to do is talk about the $800 in your checking account. Both candidates did agree the gas tax is not the way to fund road projects in the future because people are now using less gas so, they won't so that fund won't generate as much cash. Reporting live, Eric Loney, KXY4 HD News.